Ukraine breaks through the defense and Russians retreat. Ukrainian troops are gradually breaking through the front line in the south, breaking through Russian defenses. At the same time, the invaders are trying to launch a counter-attack in the Rabatino region in the direction of Zaporizhia. This was said by Konstantin Denisov, a soldier of the Freedom Legion. High-intensity fighting continues in the Rabatino region. Artillery is working from both sides. The enemy is raising planes into the sky. We have tactical successes in this direction, but it is very expensive, he said. He noted that the Russian military is hitting Ukrainian equipment with aviation and Lancet strike drones. In addition, Russians use FPV drones against Ukrainian infantry. As a result of high-quality intelligence, the armed forces of Ukraine are gradually breaking through the enemy's defense. The invaders are trying to put our guys under fire. That is, the Russians are retreating and then they are trying to hit them with artillery from the flanks. But the military does not allow it, Konstantin Denisov added. Since the capture of Robotyne, a key village in the southeastern Zaporizhia region, Ukraine is advancing more quickly after more than two months of slogging through Russian defenses at an unexpectedly slow pace. The main objectives are to take the town of Tokmak and further south from that, the city of Melitopol. The goal is to cut off the land bridge connecting mainland Russia to the Crimean Peninsula. If Ukraine can liberate both Novo Propivka and Vobov, it could then surround the town of Tokmak.